little child, not as a little boy. I really thought New York City was the entire state of New York. And I was like, God, wow, there's a whole have, world out there. Like, you wow, heard of upstate? They have trains that go all the way over there. And then I learned. <laughs> all the way to Canada, too. Could you imagine? That'd be really great. But anyway, what I have right now is High Cam X. And of course, Ray Luna, which I had just seen a few times um, at Waypoint as well, uh, a little bit earlier this week. So, definitely very familiar with the Bayo that they've been playing recently. Well, not, not even recently, they, they solo main Bayo, I believe. So, I love watching the Bayo, but Camex, I know Camex. Hi, Camex. Yeah, Camex always... has this really solid, solid Sonic. I was peeping to see, you know, who potentially would get top 8 at Xeno, and I saw Camex is a very solid contender to definitely shake things up. But Ray Luno, I see, I guess, flew under my radar. And I know the Bayos we have in New York are very formidable. Yeah, they're far and few between, but they are formidable. And I think that that's just the thing as a, as a competitive Bayo player. You see them just really, really chefs kiss their character so, so well. So, but fortunately, we have Kamex, who also is adept at, at his own character, uh, Sonic, of course. And having the, the stock lead, but are we gonna be fumbling the bag? No, we're not. We are definitely getting that four smash off for the witch's time. Okay, it's witch time, baby, for Ray Luno. And Ray Luno is looking to just get up on Kamex's shield right now, but you have to play careful against Sonic. Just getting on out there with the afterburner kick, getting Sonic in the vortex, but Kamex is just able to get a grab to chuck Ray Please. Luno <laughs> back in the corner right now, just hanging all around, trying to look for this opening. And he finds it with the back throw, just still setting up, trying to let an F smash rock to just catch a jump or something, just chilling on the ledge. I think we're just trying to get a two frame there or just neutral get up read. Oh, uh, the goofy forward smash hitbox. I love that goofy forward it's smash. So goofy, I can't. The wind up. <laughs> the wind up, and then the hands gets bigger. Like no, I can't. I can't do it. You expand. <laughs> but either way, we have Ray Luna again, one twenty percent for Bayo, and we get a combo star right now. The thing with Sonic is that he. He can do that. He can just up be right out of it with Spring. Uh, his SDI game is really good. And he's just a fast little guy. And against Bayo, uh, it's kind of something you gotta, you gotta really account for in your combos. Oh, bye. Yeah, unfortunately, getting stuck on the platform right there. KMX is just popping Ray Luno off the top with the uh, up smash. And it's still just continuing this pressure off the up airs on the platforms. Just still getting all these conversions. Nair just lingering around for so much, being a very good combo tool because that low hit stun just doing in the work. But Ray Luno getting the reversal this time, trying to snipe Kamex just coming on out, yeah. especially with that F smash. But the afterburner kicks are just still rocking him right now. Trying to go for the witch time to just bait out this, or um, trying to catch the spin dash is rolling on out. Mm -hmm. But it is still Kamex's turn to shine. He's still just going really deep oh, for all you're this. you're fine. You're fine. Your Bayo is covered really well. If you, if you still have her jump active. But this might be huge. A really good us smash. Uh, right into... Okay, there's nothing. Right into the blast zone. You are dead. And I might be seeing really take, take this game back for themselves. Yeah, Kamex has to really watch his approaches right now. Because Ray Luno has, his, has been capitalizing so much on these witch times. Escaping the spin dashes with the bat within. He sees him running on up. He just whips out an afterburner kick. Because afterburner kick, you can kind of react to it. But only if you give, your, give yourself the space to kind of do so. Wow. Now, we I'm got that say, DI. There's no way. But Sonic just has such explosive kill power with all these back airs, these mm -hmm. F smashes. But Ray Luno just gets one combo and it could be game. No, once again, trying to get for the two frame for the forest smash, but not getting it just in time for invincibility to continue to stay invincible. But that back to Rhinestar right Blast Zone, not taking it either, but you are kissing it. The next one will definitely kill yep. if, the, if it becomes that way. Yeah, dropping all these springs, trying to just knock out Ray Luno. Out of all these afterburner kicks to just come back on, but we might see Kamex just oh, be popping off the no top. Way. No, Kamex having the DI on lock right now. Ray Luno just still sniping Ooh. it out with the back here. What a very clutch comeback. I think I would almost bet that Kamex was opting to try to go and hang on the ledge after the upbeat recovery, but accidentally overlaunched himself. We can't accidentally overlaunch yourself, but you know, overlaunch himself. I mean, himself overshoot, you know? And, and yeah, overshot into the uh, the ledge. Because I think right here, look. That's literally. Oh, uh, that's, that's crazy. Wait, what? No, he definitely. That was definitely intentional. Yeah, he because yeah. he threw out an up air. I feel like yeah. he wanted to yeah, get I a saw. reversal situation. It was, a, it was an aggressive recovery. From, uh, I had to rewatch re it. Yeah. 
And Ray Luno kind of just was in a really good position to just react and throw out a back air. But going into this game too, as a reminder, it is best of five territory in top eight. So we still have another game to go after this and potentially more. And Kamex is still beginning his assault right now with the Sonic. Letting the backers kind of just rock right now and finding all these openings. Just running on in with the up air trains going online and hanging all around with the spin dash. But Ray Lino just calling out the spin dash movement with the afterburner kicks. Just rack it in on up that damage. You know, Red Luna is just trying to keep this, this, this percentage not it, not like so much in their deficit, you know? And yeah, it's just, it's close. Yeah. It's going to be a close game either way. Oh, there it is. Well, he shifted forward out smash. of the way of the up tilt into the forward smash. That's so unfortunate. Yeah, just throwing another back oh. here for good measure. Almost I thought it would kill it, I'm not gonna lie. I thought it would too. He's going for the dash attack, just trying to seal things off. Now, this is where Ray Ludo has to be careful to kind of just not fold to just Kamek's having this lead against with Sonic. Because having a lead against Sonic is probably one of the worst things you could possibly experience in this game. Because he kind of just, uh, he looks at you, he waits for that opening, you know, he finds his ins and outs. And that damage is still racking up right now. If Ray Ludo oh just gets another down there, okay. yeah. Just, just down there, just the, her heal spiked you, kill you, a boom, bam, bop. It's sharp. Yep, You're dying to that. And now Ray Ludo is now eating this back up with her own, with uh, their own combos going on right now. Bayo, I love that Bayo can literally just kind of go right around Sonic Spin Dash the way we saw with the with the uh, with their uh, combo starter right there. They always use that to just kind of start up their their aerial stuff. But I got the other things with these because I they look the same to me. I can't even lie. Oh, they they basically all the same. What uh, moves do you want to know? Take, all take the bails. All the bail moves. The afterburner kicks. I know afterburner. Oh, that's it. But we'll find out together right now. Just bail dropping down from the plat. Yep. Throwing down the back airs, being her really solid kill move that she has right now, and she's looking to take Kamex. Up in the corner right now, but just kind of resetting mm -hmm. to the ledge right now, being forced to play this situation out. And Kamex just going for a hard call out with that F smash, just trying to shade and things off. And there it off. is, one more time, taking finally taking that second lock from Kamex. And this is literally Ray uh, Ray Lunar's game. If they're able to keep this momentum going, especially with Bayo with Rage, and we have the download kind of on how Sonic works against your character uh, as Bayo. This is clearly easy game for Ray Lunar if they keep their cool already. And honestly, if you go at Sonic, at, uh, at Sonic speed, because Sonic low-key slows the game down. Like, low-key with spin dashes and stuff, you gotta be a little more patient. Yep, Sonic can definitely mm -hmm. slow it down if he so chooses so. Yep. But Ray Lino, that rage is going bye-bye right now. It's worth to just play with a clean slate right now on the Bayonetta. But still, Kamex chilling with 108 can definitely be exploding very soon here with one-touch combos from the Bayo. But you know, Sonic's just has a Sonic's camera. Yeah, so, so, yeah, Sonic's. <laughs> Sonic's so like, that ain't so no, no. That man, DR, what are you doing? <laughs> Bro, I'm a big fan of Sonic's. What can I say? That's my representation. Nah, me too. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. All right. Either way, we have Camex, not Sonic's. Cam, it's, it's too <laughs> similar. Change it. Get the X out. Nah, Sonic has changed his game up to like their own situation that they're able. Oh no! Ray, oh no, we're good, we're good. Because Kamex has still gotten this game kind of to their own speed and where they're, where oh, they're the most comfortable. Vacuum. And there it is. That's so cheese. Sonic. That's so the cheese. Va the vacuum up smash. He like dodges through what you can th throw at him and just vacuum. That's it. That hurt box shift being noxious. But I love that. Because Kamex, we saw all game has kind of just been going for those call out up smashes for these afterburner kicks or like on this movement. And you see Raylino pressing the button at the wrong time Bruh. with the jab, and Sonic just fucking avoided all of that by jumping above it all. Look at this. You touch oop. Bruh. Oop. 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 You touched Stupid. my air. Stupid. No, I'm kidding. Nice swing, idiot. <laughs> Not top 15 character, by the Can't way. Can't believe it. Your hand got in my way. Time to die. Nice disjoint is what I would say. <laughs> Some mage.
And we're taking things to Hollow Bastion here. Now, this is a very interesting stage because both characters have that middle platform to work around. It's much like Smashville, you know. Sonic has that um, that middle platform he can camp around. But for Rayluno, they have the combo extensions with um, the pressure they can do as Bayo. Mm -hmm. So we're going to see how this plays out going into this match over here. But Kamek's just already having a very solid lead right now. Just keeping Ray Luno in the corner right now with a good old one-two jab. Spin dashing to just try and get out of that situation. Call out a jump with the back air. But Ray Luno is just having a tough time just getting nice. out of these scary wow. situations. And Kamex is still just hovering all around with these... Um, with these, uh, I forget what they're called. The springs and the springs. <laughs> Oh, I forget what they're called. The springs. <laughs> little hopper guys, little trampolines. Little hopper guys. You could just say guys. upbeat. And or upbeat, yeah. yeah right. That and part always is always works. true. The Sonic upbeat. The Sonic upbeat. Just hit that upbeat. Hit them two frames. A little spring there right there. Again. I love it. It's, it's just a good way to just kind of check out your opponent when they're trying to recover safely. And it obviously clears out for some really easy four, uh, four airs. Yeah, potentially just air, takes yeah. out a jump, you know, stops their stalling. Kind of forcing them to recover at a high, a higher angle, so you can just drop down like a forward smash, or just go on there. You just drop oh, a back like of a, your a own. Tilt you know? right there. It, it's so many good options that Sonic opens up for himself when he does use his upbeat as a uh, instead of a recover option as a a tool, uh, as like a hitbox straight up as a hitbox. Yeah, he can play to the it's ledge so very well. Yeah, I know. Kamex is, is hanging on to this life as much as they can. Refusing. There we go. Oh, not getting the, the, the kill off of the fair, unfortunately. But it's okay. Oh, that's funny. Oh, the footstool? That's funny. Okay. The footstool, but like also the spring. Like, hello? Just both Here. simultaneously coming out. Very interesting. Okay. It's funny. Oh, Jab not quite killing, which is very weird. Because I know Jab normally kills. But I guess Sonic got that weight on him. Oh, that was a really hard read you're trying to go for. Yeah, trying to go for all the marbles with mm -hmm. the forward smash. Just eating up back air all for it. Kamex is looking for his approach in on Ray Luno right now. And Ray Luno just capitalizing in on this opening. But Kamex is just getting out of all these situations. Kay Ray Luno's not really able to get his own combos mm -hmm. kind of going for a kill. There it is! Goofy hitbox. The funny. The funny. The funny hand got big. Like you were saying, I, I said earlier, I think just Sonic is just fast. And he falls he out of things is. so He's much the faster than other character in the game. His exactly. air dodge is like exactly. faster than majority of the characters mm -hmm. in this roster, which is very which he, interesting. He, Not many characters are privileged like that. Yeah, he better be. That's like his whole gimmick. He's like the fastest creature on the earth. You're too slow. <laughs> You're too slow. You're too. Look at this. <laughs> there it is. Look, look at the his size of that thing. Thing. Look at his hand. It's the size of what, his what face. What is this? <gasps> chest. Just the, 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 the screen shaking is so funny. Stop. It's, it's <laughs> a reminder from Sonic Unleashed. You know? like, mm, he is the mm, big mm, werehog. Look hands. at his mm, arm. Mm, it just extends. Mm, it tapers. Why is it like thing. that? Sonic arm enhancement. Enhance. Yeah. Oh, we're often going on on on, uh, on FD, and I. I'm a big believer. You should not be taking Sonic to FD. No, um, you, I'm with you all there. You should definitely not. With his Ray Luno's uh, pick I, after. Okay. Yeah, I, BFN and Small Battle. Let, me, let me play Devil's Advocate here because I don't think that Sonic, taking Sonic to FD is the worst thing you can do. I think TNC is do. worse than FD. So, like, I think Sonic, bad to take him there. Yeah, though. like, where Sonic can, like, take you off the side with, like, his drill pick bullshit. Uh, <laughs> but also the fact that, like, some platform stages... Let him just be all the way over there all yeah. the time because of, like, spin shot. And here, like, you can kind of corner him. So, like, because then you make a lot of those 50-50s, like, with spin charge, like, l like less safe for him. Yeah. Right? It's more of a 50-50 rather than, oh, I see my opponent is uh, on the other side of the stage. Wonderful. Why that kill? Because it's, it's Sonic. Kill? It's Sonic it's, forward smash. Is, is, is that the Sonic privilege? Have you not <laughs> seen the Steve trailer where Sonic just sent Mario to another dimension with that move? But like... <laughs> it's like one of the, the strongest S matches in the game. And oh my god! Kamex is bopping the floor with right so, Luna right... Well, see, maybe in this, oh, oh. In so this Devin, case... So Devin 3000, what were you saying? Maybe in this case... <laughs> That, All right, that was, that was like, a very quick match. Whoo! That was a very quick match. Because, like, what? The bands were Battlefield and Small Battlefield. Yeah. It's like, those yeah. make sense. I, I think the but best bands against Sonic is FD and TNT. It's definitely one of those things yeah. where, like, this is a very common stage you see. And so it's just like, oh, yeah, this is where you're going to end up. But that's just because, yeah, like, that's where you it. end up banning. Yeah. 
uh, you end up banning like other stuff, and then you end up there. Yeah. And it's just like you have to play the, you have to hedge your bets, and the Sonics are gonna be very experienced on that stage. You gotta be ready. Yeah, I guess 